hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we will learn how to use if formula in microsoft excel if formula is used to check if a sale meet certain conditions if those values are true then it will provide result a otherwise if false then will provide result b let me show you how it works as we have this data we have a student's name here and marks they have obtained and based on their score we will give them credit and grade either they are pass or fail so this is our criteria if someone scored 40 or more it will be credited with one credit and grade will be pass and if someone has a scored less than 40 then he will get zero credit and result will be fail so let's start so we will use our formula here so our formula is is equals to if if then tab it is asking for logical test so what you want to test you want to check this marks we will select this and we will use this sign which is greater than greater than 39 which will be 40 right so if this sale is greater than 39 then comma then value if true so what will be the result if this is true so it will be one one credit and then comma value if false if this value is not greater than 39 then zero and break it over and enter it has automatically dragged the formula here and you can see the results at 39 it's 0 at 31 it's 0 and then if I make this 61 40 it is pass if I make it 27 it will be 0 so I will use this in results to give them grade so we will use our formula again is equals to if then tab then logical test which is same again our sale so now we will use equals to or greater than 40 which means anything above 40 or even 40 will be true then comma then we want to give them pass grade so one thing to note when we are using text here we must use quotation mark so we'll use it and then pass and quotation mark over then comma and if not true then again quotation mark file and quotation mark break it over and then enter and you can see the result here so excel has automatically done this for all in case it is not done automatically like this so you can just drag from here tell down and you will get it so you can see the result beside it if I make this 40 it will be credited with 1 and then pass I hope you have learned how to use if formula in Microsoft Excel and in coming videos I will be teaching advanced if formula which is also known as nested if where we use multiple conditions using if formula for more informative videos like this please subscribe to our channel and if you like this video please hit like comment down your questions share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe